30 were doctors bribed to prescribe a potent painkiller to patients who didn't need it. Tonight, a drug executive is answering those charges. Good evening, everybody. I'm Leah Martin. And I'm Paula Evan. Federal prosecutors say the man and other executives ran a scheme paying doctors to write prescriptions. WBZ's Beth Germano takes a closer look. Billionaire executive John Kapoor hid behind his lawyers leaving Boston's federal courthouse. But his attorneys say he's not hiding from charges that he engaged in a highly profitable scheme to promote a powerful opioid pain medication. They uh, referred to him as a co-conspirator as recently as two months ago. Uh, he, he knows about this investigation. He wants to stand and fight. The drug is Subsys, a spray version of the opioid fentanyl approved to treat cancer pain, developed by Kapoor's pharmaceutical firm Insys. Allegedly looking to boost profits, Kapoor is charged with personally recruiting doctors, offering kickbacks to illegally prescribe Subsys to thousands. After his arrest in Arizona last month, he was outfitted with a GPS monitoring bracelet. And prosecutors are fighting for him to retain it, saying he's worth $2 billion and is a flight risk. It creates a concern that he has access to leave this country, said prosecutor Nat Yeager. We can't monitor private aircraft. If he leaves, we would have difficulty getting him back. Kapoor's attorney calls that an abstract notion. He definitely would have fled by now if he wanted to. He knew about the case. He, he had the same money uh, months ago that he has now. CBS News has learned in 2016, Insys made 18,000 payments to doctors totaling more than $2 million. Kapoor's attorneys call the indictment against him flimsy at best. They've made allegations about different marketing and sales techniques by the company. That wasn't his. He was not involved in that at all. Kapoor is also accused of defrauding insurance companies, making them think they were approving payments for cancer patients. Six other company executives have also been charged in the alleged kickback scheme. A judge is now considering whether Kapoor's monitoring bracelet should be removed. Paula? 